Good evening and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. There was an attempt over the past three days to whip up some kind of a campaign to say that Sushant's death was conclusively and undoubtedly a suicide. And there were a coterie of media outlets that put out leaked claims of Dr. Sudhir Gupta saying that a conclusive report ruled out homicide. And then they were so vicious, they ran down everyone who campaigned for the truth. They put the prime accused Rhea Chakrabarti on a pedestal and in strange kind of synchronicity, Shiv Sena MP Sanjay Raut and the Mumbai Police Commissioner joined this morning to praise Dr. Sudhir Gupta for his declaration that it was a suicide. But everything changed at 10 a.m. this morning when we put out tapes of our conversations. Between our editor, Special Projects Prakash Singh with Dr. Sudhir Gupta from 40 days back. And we'll get Prakash live on the program today. In these tapes, you hear Dr. Sudhir Gupta in his own words, in his own voice and out of his own volition, raise questions and make claims that fly in the face of the suicide theory that he has now propounded. He said the autopsy reports had loopholes. Have the loopholes disappeared now? He said evidence was destroyed. Did the destroyed evidence reappear and undestroy itself now? He said the crime scene is totally contaminated. Did the contamination vanish? Further, he said to Prakash, that the crime scene was not forensically suitable to examine. Did it become suitable out of the blue? He said on record the time of death was not mentioned. So how did you identify the cause of the death and the time of the death? Ladies and gentlemen, the U-turn defies logic. Now the AIMS in its official statement has disowned all such claims of suicide. The CBI in its statement has not ruled out murder. And millions across the nation are asking, was there a well-planned conspiracy, a well-timed conspiracy to bury the public interest campaign for Sushant? Was there an attempt to pressurize the CBI to shut down the homicide angle? Why was Dr. Sudhir Gupta turned into a mascot by the Sonia Sena and their crony media? And with murder not ruled out, with the CBI giving its statement today, with the AIMS disowning Gupta's leaks, where are the set of pseudos now? Ladies and gentlemen, that's debate number one, a super exclusive report that has really sent ripples across the country today. The biggest expose of the biggest cover-up is debate number one tonight and debate number two this evening. What is the Hathras truth? Now, there are different angles and different truth, do different uh, pieces of evidence which are coming out. And the rape and gang rape theories are being questioned now, now that all that is coming out. That bunch has run away from that as well. All this and more is coming up. And debate number three this evening, viewers, the riot conspiracy has unraveled. It was now clear that like in the Delhi riots, there was an attempt to, to create a situation of communal violence as a result of Hathrat. All this is being exposed now. Hi everyone, I'm Sujarita Kukreti. Thanks for checking out Republic World. If you would like to watch more show highlights and live coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the Republic World News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.